The last couple of days have been very low key because it's been raining. Literally, it's just been raining off and on. So <laughs> um, today I am resetting my bedroom. I'm super excited. And um, look at this. This is going to be the wall for my TV. It's just so bare. Like it makes me want to put something on it now. But anyway, um, I had already moved my bed around in front of the window. I think I showed you guys that in the last clip. And then um, my little brothers came and helped me with my dressers. So now it's just a matter of like, adding some small things to make it look more homey and more sexy and more grown. So I'm excited. Um, I brought the Eiffel Tower picture up already from downstairs. And then I also printed a picture of me. Um, and I bought the frame. Well, I printed the picture at Walgreens. I bought the frame from Target. And I'm putting that up as well. Um, and my nightstands are coming today. I ordered nightstands from Amazon. I'm a little nervous because I chose to not have them assemble it just because I didn't want to pay the extra price. So I'm I'm nervous because I'm hoping it's not too difficult to do by myself. <laughs> um, I can't wait to show you guys because they're so cute. I just hope that they're like, I hope they're the right size. hope they're the right height. I think they'll be good. But they're coming today. So I'm excited about my nightstands. And um, I've been searching for duvet covers like in store so that I don't have to wait but all the good duvet covers you have to order. Like Kohl's has some really good ones, but none of them were available in the store. You had to order them online. And I'm, I wasn't trying to wait. I'm being like low key impatient. So one place I know has amazing duvet covers for an affordable price is Ikea. <laughs> and I'm like 20 minutes from Ikea. I'm like South Jersey, Philly is right there. So I am low key thinking about crossing the bridge today to get me a duvet cover i was trying to avoid going to ikea because you know when you go in there you is not leaving with one thing but i'm going for a duvet cover we'll see if i walk out with one thing or more but i'm excited about that because i have all these comforters i have a comforter someone gave me and then i have the original comforter i bought when i first bought the house and they're not bad i'm just not feeling it you know i like the duvet i like that they're heavy i like that uh they're warm you can get warm or cool but the one i like is the warm one and um, I like that I'll be able to change it, you know, how I like instead of buying like a whole new comforter. So it's about time I'm, I'm overdue for a duvet cover. So I'm doing that. Um, what else am I doing today? Laundry. <laughs> Today's like an adulting day. Today's definitely an adulting day because I have to do laundry. Besides, I have to wash my sheets, but I also have clothes I need to wash. Um, I need to go to Best Buy to get me a new external microphone because the one that I have is currently like it's literally broke. I'm also just say it's broke because it gives so much feedback. I have to like do so much to edit um, my voice in post-production like after I record a video and I don't feel like doing all that. So I'm going to get a new external microphone and uh, I don't remember what else I have on my agenda today. But right now I'm waiting for my Amazon packages so I can come over. I'm so excited. Oh, also, so all of my outlets in my room are black. Every other room in the house was changed to white, but my bedroom. So my friend is coming over later to change all of my outlets to white, which I'm excited about because I don't know about y'all, but that makes a big difference to me. So he's going to change all the outlets to white, of course, with a white plating so that that's done. And then, yeah, so today I'm just resetting my bedroom, running some errands. And um, my mom wants me to go Christmas shopping with her. So that may not happen until later, like after like afternoon. So, um, I might do that. And I think that's it. <laughs> I don't know. I have a lot going on, but, um, of course I'm going to get dressed first, eat some breakfast and then get my day started. So my outlets have changed. So excited. See, now they're white. I can't, I'm sorry. There we go. <laughs> now they're white. So excited. I am waiting on Amazon. I really hate when they give you a window, a delivery window. My delivery window is 1 15 to 4 o'clock. And I really want to be here when it gets here because I don't know how big those nightstand boxes are. And I don't want them just sitting in front of my house. But like, I'm going to wait 30 more minutes. If they're not here in 30 minutes, I'm going to run out, do what I need to do, come back. But I'm really hoping they get here within the next 30 minutes because I want them to be in the house. I'm going to put them together and then I'm going to leave and do what I need to get. Amazon is here. Oh, I can't even open the door. Hello. Hi. There you go. Thank you. 
got my friend here to help me put this together because I do not want to mess it up. These are the instructions. They look pretty simple. Pretty simple, I think. Thank you. Cut myself with this knife. Moving too fast. I think these are both. Okay, so these are the nightstands. So then, where the heck is my? Maybe that's what this is. I ordered a like a mat thingy. Oh, here it is. Okay, I'm dumb. I'm slow. Okay, that's that's all my office stuff. So then, these two boxes are the nightstands. Got it. Makes sense now. Okay, yeah, you can put that in the office. Thank you. All right. Now let's try to put this bad boy together. I'm nervous. Let's move the knife so we don't kill ourselves. That thing's probably dying or dead. You hear it, right? <laughs> Okay, so we got some legs. I'm nervous at how this is gonna come out. But this is a lot of work. I think they're gonna like sleep. One at a time, obviously. I'll open the rest of the This is the one piece. I'm assuming they're all the same size. Okay, so four. Huh? Four long pieces. And I should have four of these. Yeah, I have four of these. And eight screws. Okay. Let's put the bottom. These things. I think, oh, those like grips, like if you have a car before. I'm satisfied with the height they're not too short and I'm satisfied with the size but now I just need to decorate them maybe put some decor at the bottom put some books in the middle and then the top I don't know I gotta figure out how to decorate these but you guys let me know how you like them I think it was a pretty good buy I'm gonna link them in the description box so you guys know um, which ones they were I got them from Amazon though it was originally for my desk, but I think I'm going to put it on my nightstand just because it matches my nightstand. So, it's for my phone. So, I bought a new laptop case from Amazon as well. So, I'm just opening it up right now. And I'll show you guys in a second. Alright, so this is the top of it. No, clock. This is the top of it, and then this is the bottom of it for my laptop. I really like the color. I hope you guys can see that. It's a nice material too. It's a pretty gray. And then and it comes with this cute little bag. 
And they give you a screen protector too, which I'm a little nervous about putting this on. So I'm gonna do this later. I love the color. It's like a grayish color. Disregard my laptop, it needs to be cleaned off. But it's pretty, I love the color. But now maybe I'll put the apple sticker on the middle. Let me know if you guys think I should put the apple sticker on the middle or if I should just leave it like that. I don't know. But this is my new case. I love it. It's so pretty. I have to put this. I have to put this on. But I'm nervous. So we'll see. It's supposed to be a little. Oh, that's a perfect size too. Ooh, I need to put that on. Okay. Yep. That's the case. Hey guys. So I'm back. I finally was able to switch from my phone to my camera because yeah anyway um i'm just not leaving best buy i had to get me a new external microphone because my other one is like girl done so i got the new road mini whatever my jigger the one that every creator uses so i'll link that in the description box if anybody wants to know what external microphone i use anyway um before i do anything though food is my portion because your girl is hungry um and then i'm going to see if i can score a duvet cover in one of these stores i'm in a town where there's like mad stores around here like mad home stores so i'm going to try to go into one of those stores to see if i can score a duvet cover and some decor for my new nightstands um if not then i'm just going to cross the bridge to go to ikea because who has the time who has the time to go to five million stores um i really should just go to ikea but i just have this really good feeling that i'm going to find something without me having to go all the way to Ikea. Because y'all know, Ikea is like an all-day trip. And I know I'm only going there for one thing, but it's like 16 floors. It's like, it's a lot going on. So I'm trying to avoid going there and being overwhelmed and staying there for seven hours. When I can just go to one of these little home stores around here, <clears throat> see what type of comforters or duvet, co duvet covers they have, some decor they have, and then I can just take my happy tail home. Oh, well, I'm back at home and i'm excited i found a few things at the store i did not go to ikea i ended up going to bed bath and beyond and i scored me a king size comforter super comfortable and the brand is really good so i'm happy i didn't have to cross the bridge i also went to burlington to get a few like small decor for these nightstands but i also am using some things around the house because i was like i think i have some things laying around the house that i can probably stick in there i could move some things around like things that are on my dresser and things like that so I'm out to decorate the nightstands in the bed, and I want you to come along. I know the comforter is wrinkled so just just bear with me okay um first of all it's a regular comforter but it really looks like and feels like a duvet so eventually I'm going to buy a duvet cover and treat this as an insert and um it'll probably be like a different color but for now I just put it on the bed because I didn't find one at the store I went to but I got this one from Bed Bath and Beyond and I'm going to show you the brand of it give me one second so it's the Nestwell Organic Cotton king comforter set of course it came with one comforter and two shams so two king size shams so the big pillows behind the small pillows are the size pillowcases that came with it um my sheets are not pure white because i didn't want them to be pure white they're kind of like a off-white grayish color and they're from ugg super comfortable i don't even remember where i got those from nightstand decor the phone case came from amazon the glasses came from burlington i don't even remember where the Eiffel Tower thingy came from. I had that for a long time. 
This came from Burlington as well. I don't remember where these flowers came from. I just had them around the house. <laughs> so y'all saw this already, the plant. You know, I gotta make sure I got my Bible on my nightstand. The, the book I'm currently reading, Do It Afraid by Joyce Meyer. And then this is just a little decor. Now to the good part. <laughs> this chair, you guys remember was in the other corner. I moved it over here. That small little table I got from my office and I decided to put books on it as well with some highlighters that sign and this cute little fake plant that my little brother got me. Then this is the portrait that I printed. It's kind of bad because of the lighting. I hate the ceiling fan y'all, I'd be jacking up my pictures. <laughs> but this is the portrait that I printed from Walgreens and the frame is from Target. Okay, on the opposite wall, this is the other dresser, the small dresser. I just have my toiletries, a candle, of course my iPad set up with the time. I got that stand from Amazon as well. And then this is the Eiffel Tower picture that was in the living room that I brought upstairs. So I love this little area. This little area is everything. I'm still trying to figure out what I'm gonna do here on these walls. This dresser opens up as a jewelry box. So I don't really wanna put anything on top of it that isn't easy to remove. Guys, I'm super happy with how the room came out. Um, yes, my comforter is really wrinkled but that's okay this is my favorite part of the room okay this picture in this little sitting area the sitting area and the picture definitely my favorite part of the room um i just love everything about it i am slowly but surely getting my grown sexy cozy room and honestly it looks 10 times better in person like video is just not capturing how the room really looks um it's really not like especially these nightstands like y'all probably think they look so simple and stupid but they are so cute um so yeah i am happy with everything until i get me like a lamp like either nightstand lamps or like a lamp to go like in this little sitting area or whatever until i get that i'm going to be kind of i'm satisfied but not 100 percent satisfied especially when i get rid of this ceiling fan i think that's when the game is going to change because I'll be able to have a like a really cute light fixture. Um, I'll be able to change the light bulbs in it to what I want. And then I'm thinking my nightstands or my floor lamp could either be like a warm light. That way at night it's just kind of like that cozy vibe. You know what I'm saying? This is phase one of the room reset. And I just have a small few more things to do. It's not really a lot. Just, you know, get the duvet cover that I really want. Like the color because I really don't want white. Um, I mean, white is cozy, but I'm thinking of a different color. So when I find the perfect color, I will show you guys it and hopefully you guys like it. Um, and then of course some lamps and that's really it. Of course this TV, you know, there's just other small little bits that I need to get done. But for the most part, I love how it came out. I'm happy I moved the bed. I'm happy I moved the dressers where I moved the dressers. I'm happy I moved this like, Eiffel Tower picture upstairs. I'm just happy overall with what's going on. I'm happy. Tell me guys if you like it. Um, give me some ideas. If you think I should change something, if you think I should add something, give me some ideas. But I'm pretty satisfied. So, yes. Um, yeah. That's pretty much all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. Um, you guys will be getting some more Vlogmas videos. I just have to gather my life. <laughs> and schedule them correctly and figure out what I'm doing next week. It's probably going to be a lot of last minute shopping next week, uh, right before Christmas. So, um, yeah, so that's all I have for you. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.